I'm ready to be brave. I'm ready to be brave. So, ready to be brave. The song itself is 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 really about you know someone having to have a difficult conversation and mustering up the courage to do that. When I decided to turn it into a that I wanted that to be a music video, I, I found who I thought would be the right director, and he's really great at telling stories through his videos and and what what he wanted to do um which resonated well with me is he wanted to specifically talk about the difficult conversation of a young boy coming cu coming out um but but it's not it's not just a you know he, but he wanted to do it in a beautiful real way so it's set on a farm and it tells the story of of of, of a young boy sort of reconciling his his uh love for his father who's a traditional you know far, farm guy uh and he want, he has to sort of reconcile that with his own coming out and who he is and those and and the director came up with this script that tells this story so perfectly i'm so excited that the song came to life that way because it's it's still a real thing like uh, lgbtq plus people i'm you know i'm one of this community it's still actually a difficult conversation a lot of the time. So doing it through a video, I think will sort of help to, to normalize this type of thing. I thought of walking away at least a thousand times. But that kind of walking is for the week. I, I'm honored to get to sort of to bring this message to life, you know, it's in a certain not, it's not the first time this message has been brought to life, but I'm I'm honored to contribute to the conversation and contribute to the normalization of this. And uh, you know, it, it's it's funny. Like people say, uh, you know, I, I have a toe in the water in Toronto. I'm there a fair bit. I would say in Toronto, it's it's this might be a, 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 a little. It's a little more common. The LGB all things LGBTQ are a little more common. Still not easy. You don't see a lot of people, not a lot of queer couples walking down the street holding hands. So so it's not it's not as it's not as cut and dried as a lot of people would like to say it is. In Western Canada, it's even rarer to see queer people walking down the streets holding hands. There's a reason why that is. A lot of people I know in the LGBTQ plus community, th there's actually still a bit of a fear. Uh, and, and where does it, I mean, that's a whole big conversation, right? So I'm just glad that this video can be yet another sort of piece in this big puzzle of just putting the message out there in, into the world that, hey, you know, here's here's some of the things queer people sort of have to deal with that, that you know, people who aren't in the queer community might not sort of realize is going on all the time. And, and it, it's an honor to tell the story.